Hello everybody, this is Nanduram and we are from Sunu Academy. Today we are going to discuss about Environmental Studies Class 4 CBSE Syllabus. Today's our topic is River Stain. Children, look carefully at the picture of the river. Read, at least try to imagine the flows of the river given in the below pictures. Use these pictures to make a story. Yes, give a little title to your story also. Let us see here some of the pictures that the boat flowing in a water, blue fish, water plants, rivers, foul smell, big sheep, oil, river banks, factories, washing clothes, animals, other works, changing city. Children, by using these all the words, you can make a small story about the river tail. Before going to make a story, let us see how this river can flow from one place to another place and where it reaches. Let us see how the river water flow. The color of the river water changes as it floats downwards to the plains. Now you see the color of the water. The water pollution is the main cause of change in color of river water. How does the water become dirty? Yes, you saw in the picture as the river flowed through or near many villages, towns and cities. By this, the water is going into change. At this time, the people used the river water for many different things such as washings, clothing, washing clothes, bathing animals and cleaning utensils. In many of the cities made up of water dirty. Yes, the water in the river kept changing as it flowed through various places. Water in ponds and lakes can also become dirty due to the similar reasons. From where do you get drinking water? Just you think, yes, we get drinking water from rivers or lake. Do you think that like that river in the picture, your river or lake can also be affected? Yes, definitely, yes, our drinking water also can be affected by these reasons. Because many of towns and factories are built near our rivers, so that they can use water from the river. But sometimes the water is not cleaned before it is put back into river. This dirty water means mixing of air and of soil is called pollution. Let us see some of the reasons for pollutions. Pollutions can be in a variety of forms. For example, rubbish like crepes packets, newspapers and bags, oil, poisonous substance, cans, bottles and other solid objects, human wastes, excrement, etc. This can be thrown in the water. It can cause us the water pollution. Causes of water pollution. There are several causes of water pollution in India. The main causes are the briefly described as under. There are urbanization. Yes, children, rapid urbanization in India during the recent decades has given rise to the number of environmental problems such as water supply, water waste water generating and its collecting, treatment and disposal. Many towns and cities which came up on the banks of rivers have not given a proper thought to problem of water waste, sewage etc. The second cause of water pollution is agricultural. Children, you can see the farmers put fertilizers and pesticides on their crops. So their crops grow better. For this press fertilizers and pesticides, it can be washed through the soil by rain to end up in the rivers. The fertilizers and pesticides are harmful because they cause algae to grow. The algae can destroy water plants. Another reason for water pollution is factories. 